Want to discover one of Northwest London's best neighborhoods that no one knows about? Then stay tuned because today we're going to be showcasing Mapesbury Conservation. Hi everyone, I'm Ugo Renze with Onyx Property Team in Keller Williams. I'm a London-based property agent and I help my clients buy, sell, rent, and manage property throughout London. On my YouTube channel, I share lots of great information about the London property market and living in this amazing city. So if you haven't already, I would really love it if you subscribe and hit that notification bell and make sure to leave me a comment because we can show YouTube that I'm putting out great content. Today's video is all about Mapesbury Conservation or the broader Mapesbury area. Both are little known for those who don't live in the area and often referred to as either Willesden or Kilburn where the tube stations are located. Today I'm highlighting this community because it's where I live and work and I think it's pretty special. And in fact, it might also be one of Northwest London's best kept secrets. Tucked between larger neighborhoods of West Hampstead to the east, Bronsbury to the west, Kilburn to the south and Wilson Green to the north, Mapesbury is easily confused or referred to as any one of these areas because it doesn't have its own distinct high street. But what makes this area so wonderful is that it's this little enclave of wide, tree-lined streets and classic homes dating back to the late 1800s. Designated a conservation area in 1982, the beauty and details of many of the houses have now been preserved. So where exactly is it? The actual boundaries are the rear of homes on Anson Road to the north, south is at Christchurch Avenue and the Kilburn Tube Station, east are the rear houses of Shoot Up Hill, and the west boundary is at Wilsden Lane. The homes are really special because many have red brick or white stucco facades with intricate details including coving and beautiful stained glass windows. Built between 1870s and 1920, these Victorian and Edwardian era homes have been influenced by the arts and crafts movement, Gothic and classic architectural forms. The homes are typically large two and three story detached or semi-detached properties, though some have been converted into flats. With the, many have rear gardens that often exceed 25 meters in depth, some with mature fruit trees, Many have well-sized front gardens, typically eight meters deep, and thick brick walls at the front walk and tall gate posts. So really quite distinct and special characteristics as you walk throughout the neighborhood. The Maidsbury Residents Association plays a pivotal role within the planning system, providing comment on a majority of the planning applications that are submitted within the conservation area. While the area doesn't have a distinct or dedicated high street, Walmlade at the northern edge runs into Wilsden Lane near the Wilsden Tube station and offers a great mix of local restaurants and shops. The Queensbury is a great gastro pub at the corner of Dartmouth Road that is definitely worth checking out. Neighborhood favorites on the Wilson side include Coco Bees offering Caribbean and Latin infused tapas, Bee Grill which serves up authentic Portuguese cuisine and rustic atmosphere, and the popular Italian restaurant Sanzio's. There's also O'Farrell's Family Butchers providing excellent service and prime choice cuts. Zen W2 Yoga and Pilates is your local source for well-being and relaxation. You've also got Cricklewood Broadway nearby, or if you're at the south, at southern end of Mapesbury, you might opt to frequent the Kilburn High Road mix of restaurants, convenience stores, and shops, and there are plenty. Or if you even want to walk another 15 minutes, you can head into West Hampstead. For your closest green space, there's Mapesbury Dell, the area's best kept secret. This magical, award-winning pocket park provides residents with stunning gardens along with a play area for children, a pond with wildlife, green space, picnic tables, and benches. If you're looking for larger green space, there's Kilburn Grange and nearby nestled just off of Kilburn High Road with eight acres, or Gladstone Park is in jogging distance with 86 acres. For transport, there's Wilson Green and Kilburn Tube Stations with the Jubilee Line providing easy and direct access to Baker Street, Mayfair, Oxford Street, Westminster, Canary Wharf, and Stratford. You're also going to be nearby to the Bronsbury Overground Station, which provides direct access to many stops including Kew Gardens, Imperial Wharf, Clapham Junction, and Richmond to the West, and Habstead's Heath, Highbury Islington, Hackney, and Stratford to the East. 
In addition, the high road offers plenty of bus options as well as easy driving access to the M1. This area also has great school options and you'll have an extensive array of choice. Good or outstanding primary schools in the area include Our Lady of Grace, Northwest London Jewish Day School, Mallory's Infant School, and Emmanuel Church of England Primary School. For secondary school options, there's Hampstead School, Crest Academy, and Maple Down School. Entertainment, you're less than a mile from Kilburn Theatre, formerly known as the Tricycle Theatre, with its award-winning seasons of plays and performances. Average house prices in Mapesbury Conservation are about at about 800 pounds a square foot, but many of these homes are larger single-family homes with over 2,000 square feet, so many detached homes sell in the range of two to three and a half million pounds. An average two-bedroom flat ranges from 550 to 750,000. But having said that, this area offers great value from, let's say, a West Hampstead, where for the same two million pound budget, you're gonna get definitely a lot less square footage and definitely not those extensive gardens that makes Mapes Bear Conservation so special. So my top five reasons to absolutely live and love Mapesbury is at number one, the large homes with expansive gardens. Number two, it's the wide tree-lined streets. Number three, it's easy transport and proximity to central London. Number four are the great local eateries. And number five are the excellent schools. So I hope this video has given you a sense of Mapesbury Conservation and why it's so special. If you want to know more about this neighborhood or any others in London, make sure to reach out to me and make sure to leave me a comment below if you discovered something you might love about Mapesbury Conservation. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to check out the other videos on my YouTube channel where I share great things about the London property market and living in this incredible city. So that's Ugo Renze with Onyx Property Team and Keller Williams. Bye for now.